What's going on everybody? Jealous you Maniac coming back at you for another little break. And today we're taking a look at the rookie card explosion box. And this is the first one of January or the first one of 2022, I should say. January, I believe this is volume 37. And if you look on there, he's got him a new logo. It used to tell the volume number in there. But he has done some bigger things with this box. Not only does he have the regular baseball box, he has a high-end baseball box, and he did a football box. I'm going to try to move my regular subscription up to the high-end box if he offers that. He did them for one-time purchases only, and those sold out real fairly quickly, y'all. They didn't last too long, and rightfully so because this is always just such a great product. And once again, we got a really good lineup, y'all. Last year wasn't the greatest year for us on the Rookie Card Explosion Box. Now, they had some massive, massive hits pulled out of this box. You can go to the Facebook group, his Facebook group, and see just how much and how many big hits came out of it. Just didn't land our way, but we're going to try to turn that around this year, y'all. There it is, Volume 37. And you can check that lineup. We got 13 update all the way down to 21 series one. A lot of nice stuff in here. 2020 Bowman. That is a hobby pack, man. That'd be nice to get some Bobby Whip, man. And there it is. WorkyCardExplosionBox.com, Instagram, YouTube, Twitter. He doesn't have his Facebook page, but you can search RC Explosion Box and Facebook and you can find him. So guys, here we go. Let's look at the packs and see how we want to open them. There's that 2013 update. Arenado, Yelich, and Garrett Cole. We got some 16 tops chrome. Four cards. I don't know who all's in there. Seager, Turner, Story, Carlos Correa. I should have known that. That's a product I have never ripped. 2018 or yeah, 18 pro debut. A lot of nice stuff in there. We got some uh, 19 Optic, looking for some very nice rookies there. There's that Bowman hobby. We got last year's 2020 Tops Chrome. Yeah, 2020 Tops Chrome. Drew a blank for a minute. We got another hobby pack of this year's Bowman, 2021 and 2021 Series 1. So, let's do it like this. This. Probably should do that 2021 Tops Chrome. And we'll finish with the two Bowmans. Here we go, y'all. January 2022. It's a new year. Let's go. <laughs> Excuse me. I believe the high-end version, guys, that he was selling, you know, these are under 100 bucks. I think that high-end version was... 159 or 149 it was under 200 dollars it had a nice lineup as well daniel johnson dalton varsho the good old flip can't go without a tops flip arcia we got my boy straight out of lsu baby mr alex bregman nice card not gonna have any insert or parallels in this pack and starting it off, nothing too crazy. A few uh, mediocre rookies in there. Up next, 2021 Tops Chrome. This was such a brutal set this year. The autograph checklist was just so, so big. Nothing thick in it. Mr. Martinez Lester. Prismic Power of Bryce Harper. And I'll take that a Joey Bart. We'll get to see him next year in action with buster posey leaving baseball all right up next we're gonna keep it with the chrome 2016 tops chrome carlos correa in here looking more and more likely like he will not be back with the astros looking more and more like the yankees might get him actually there's mr two eyes max scherzer edwin encarnacion there's a gorgeous mike trout perspectives and i absolutely love that set that year that is a really really nice card and we got a kentamaida check that out kentamaida rookie 
So nothing too crazy, but a couple of nice cards. I'll take it. All right, y'all. We got 2018 Pro Debut. I'm going to see who all he's got listed in here. He's got Soto, Acuna, Tatis, and Guerrero. I'm assuming you can get autographs with some of those guys. Let's check it out. Going to have that 2018 design. And let's see what we can find, y'all. Mr. Shane Bass. Old Bubba Thompson. Drew Waters. I don't know who that is. We got John Springstube Stub for the taco. Jose Siri Estrada and DS. So nothing. I don't think we got anything, but they might have. I'll go back at the end and look. Cause sometimes they put image variations in there, different things like that. All right, here we go. Here's a nice one. 2020 Tops Chrome. See if we can get us a Bichette, Jordan, one of the big rookies. No thickies in there. I do see a refractor. Tim Anderson. Lorenzo Kane and a refractor is going to be a Brandon Belt. All right, man. We got to pick it up. Four cards in this pack. 2019 Donruss Optic. Tatis, Vlad, Pete Alonzo. Man, what a nice set. And these come out of mega boxes, so there is a chance at an auto. Don't look like we're going to get the auto. I see an optic hollow coming up. We got King Felix Ramirez and a Cole Tucker hollow. And we got a rated rookie of Cedric Mullins. What a year, bounce back year he had, huh? Up next, our oldest pack of this month, 2013 Update Series. Let's see what we can find out of here. Got a rookie to start it out, and there it is, guys. Mr. Nolan Arenado, and that's the first one I have in my collection. And that's what's so good about opening this rookie card explosion box. It gives you that opportunity. Very nice card. Off-centered, slightly left to right. But that is a nice one. That is what I wanted to see. And like I said, I don't have any of his cards or rookies in my collection at all. And a really clean design, real simple design too. Jed Lowry, King Felix again. We got us a King Griffey Jr. Gomes. Who else we got in here? Mr. Brian Wilson, straight out of LSU, baby. Loved him. Young Paul Goldschmidt and a Matt Harvey. So very nice, man. Nolan Arenado, I'll definitely take it. And we're going to finish with two hobby packs of 2021 and 2020 Bowman. Can we sneak out one of the autos? Here we go. No thickies, no thickies, no thickies. Mr. Otani Blackman. Harper, our chromes are going to be Detmers, Soderstrom. And I'll take that. We'll take it. Not bad, Mr. S uh, Jose Salas. One of the better prospects in that set this year. Blade and Brett Beatty. All right. Did we save the big one for the last one? Let's see, y'all. Last pack magic. 2020 Bowman. And we do have an Atomic, so I'll take it. Not going to be an auto. These are one per box, these Atomics. Let's see who we can get, y'all. There's an Aquino. Mr. Cease. There's Arenado again. Got us a first paper of Baron Laura, so not bad there. We'll take him. Sahaja, uh, Sahas, I think is the way you say his name. Josh Young. And our chrome, we got a Sixto Sanchez, and not a first, Bryson Stott. And like they said, these are not numbered, but a very, very nice and highly desirable card if you pull the right name. Obviously, he was a draft in, or, or class of 2019 in Bowman Draft. Well, guys, there it was. I mean, not the best box in the world, but it is not a terrible box at all. I will take that Nolan Arenado all day. A couple of nice prospects and rookies. We got 11 more months, y'all. It's got to be better than 2020. I say we're starting off on the right track. 
Guys, thank y'all so much. If you don't mind, please leave me a thumbs up, and I'll see y'all on the next one. LSU Maniac out of here.